and welcome back. Today's video is going to be a brand new unboxing. I have my Allure Beauty Box for the month of May that I will be unboxing in today's video. I'll be sharing all the products, swatches, and everything that came in this month's box. So if you're ready, let's go ahead and get started. So we have our Allure Beauty Box. I've yet to open this, so I'm curious to see what is inside. If you are new to my Allure Beauty Box unboxings, I do these every single month here on my channel. Allure is a beauty box subscription service that is $15 a month, and you normally receive four to five products inside of it. It's not always full size. Sometimes there are like sample size items. Sometimes they're full size. It just kind of depends. Last month we got a really good box so I'm excited to see what we got for the month of May. So here is what the bag looks like this month. It's like a neon orange color and then there are a few different products that are out in the loose. So up first we have something from HelloFresh. So this is just like a little gift card. So it says $60 um, gift card is $20 off your first three deliveries plus free shipping. So I'm assuming this is probably off like your first purchase. Yeah, so new customers only. I've ordered HelloFresh before so I wouldn't be able to use this. But if you want, let me know down below. I can give you like the voucher code for this if you're interested. But this is nice to have in there. And then also we have a lip gloss. This is from Laritzi and this is in the shade Vibe. In my little booklet, it looks like this retails for $20 and it is a nude shade, which I always love getting nude lip products because those are my favorite to wear. So this is, again, a lip gloss. It's kind of like a very pale, like very, very like orangey nude. So there is a swatch of that. I've tried a few products from Laritzi. I can't remember if I've tried their lip glosses or not. I know I tried their liquid lipsticks. Um, and I wasn't the biggest fan of them, so I'm hoping that the lip gloss is better. It smells really good. Now moving on to the products inside of the bag. I do see this powder, which I'm curious about. So this is the Erase Cleansing, Exfoliating, and Brightening Powder. This is from Lou by Jean Seo. So here's what that looks like. I'll have to read about this because I'm really not sure exactly what this is. So it says, combine the loose powder exfoliator made with milk powder in oats with water. Apply, wait a minute, massage it in. It's going to unclog your pores and render skin as soft as a baby in a tiny velour tracksuit. Okay, so this is priced at $15. It looks like this is a full-size item. It kind of looks like it would be similar to like the microfoliant from Dermalogica, like a powder that you're going to like turn into an exfoliator. So I'll definitely give this one a try and kind of see how it compares to the Dermalogica one because I know that one is pretty pricey. So up next we have this here from Saint Tropez. So this is the Purity Self Tan Bronzing Water. And this one is going to be just like a deluxe size, but this one originally is $44 for the full size. So I believe this is a tanning water. I didn't even know they had one of those. These are becoming quite popular, like the spray, like tanning waters. I know I have one from Tan Lux that I really like. I've tried the Ideal Paradise one as well. So this one is from Saint Tropez. So I have to, I don't know if this is going to be enough to like do to see exactly how it goes. I think this would be. So this might get me like a full tan, I would think, for my entire body. I feel like that's a decent amount so I'll have to try this one out and see how it compares again to the other one so I'm realizing that this one is actually the face one so there's two different ones that are on here we have the self tan bronzing water gel that one's $44 and then we have this one which is the face water mist so this one is actually for the face and the full size of this one is $30 so that's my correction there so they do have a gel version and then this one is a spray this one is for the face so up next in here from Amore Pacific, we have the Youth Revolution Radiance Cream and Mask. And it looks like, again, this is going to be like a little deluxe sample of that. Here is what the packaging looks like on that. So this one is going to be a hydrating mask that doesn't smell like anything. It can wear, be worn overnight to focus on disease and have brighter skin by the morning. It says that this is a $200 product. So obviously you're getting a smaller version of it, but it is a very, very pricey product. So I'd be curious to see how it works for the price of $200. I would hope it would do something amazing. So here's what the inside looks like. So it's going to be just like a sleeping mask, it seems like. So then we have two more products. So we have the Eye Lights Metallic Eyeshadow. This one is from Model Co. So it looks like this one is a full size, and this one's going to be $12 regularly. Go ahead and swatch it so we can see what it looks like. I love like liquid cream eyeshadows, so I'll probably like this one, and I love these shades like this. It's like a champagne, like a pinky champagne. That actually looks really, really pretty. It seems pretty pigmented. I'll have to see how it is on the eyes and how it stays and everything, but it looks pretty nice, even blended out. 
Okay, and then the last item in our Allure Beauty Box this month is from Laneige. I love a lot of Laneige's products. So this is the Moisture Cream and it is for normal to dry skin. And I'll go ahead and open this one. So this one, again, is going to be a deluxe size. So here's what that looks like. I've actually heard really good things about this product. So this is the Water Bank Moisture Cream. And this one's just supposed to be like a moisturizer, but I've heard a lot of people talk really good things about this one. So the full price on this one is $35. The full size has 1.6 ounces, and this one just has 0.2. So obviously you're just getting a small, small amount, but it would be enough to kind of tell how you feel about the product. I don't mind getting the smaller products in the subscription service because I do feel like they give you a decent amount of them to where you can still kind of test them out. It is only $15 so you do get some full size and then some trial sizes. So I think all over this box is pretty good this month. We did get some skincare products but we also had a few makeup products as well with the lip gloss and then we also had that eye product. I'm actually really curious about the tanning water because I haven't really tried much from Saint Tropez so I'm kind of excited to try that out. So let me know down below what you guys think of this month's box. Are you planning on getting it? Have you already signed up? Have you gotten yours? What did you receive? Let me know all of that down in the comment section. Give this one a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. I will have the link down below to sign up for a lure box in case you are interested in signing up. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye friends.